Hello, today we'll be making champagne poached pears with a chocolate creme anglaise and pistachios. I'm Chef Ray and you're watching Publix Aprons Cooking School online. So let's get started. I have one cup of oat milk and some vanilla. We want our oat milk to come up to temperature. We wanna see a little bit of steam, but we really don't wanna boil it. So this will just take a couple minutes. Uh, while that's going on, I have some egg yolks and some sugar. And we wanna whisk this for about 30 seconds, just to make sure that that sugar breaks down and this becomes a nice homogenous mixture. Okay, so our egg yolks look good. Let's check our oat milk. And we have that steam that we're looking for. So now what we're gonna do is a process called tempering. What we wanna do is we wanna add a little bit of this hot oat milk into our egg yolks while stirring. And what this does, it helps to equalize the temperature of the egg mixture to the oat milk. And you wanna do just a few of these until your egg mixture is nice and hot. And I'm starting to see a little bit of steam coming out of these eggs. So now what we wanna do is go Put that pot back on. And we're going to now combine our tempered egg yolks with our oat milk. And we wanna stir this for about six to seven minutes. We want these eggs to cook, but we don't want them to settle on the bottom of the pan, which is why I'm using my rubber spatula here. And I'm getting into the corner of that pot to be able to have those eggs be nice and distributed. And what we're looking for is a consistency called nappe. Take a little bit on your spoon, run your finger across. If it doesn't run into itself, you have a nappe. So now we're going to incorporate our chocolate. We're gonna take our mixture, pour it into our bowl. And we're gonna do about six tablespoons of dark chocolate. Uh, this is 72%. So it's gonna be nice and rich, very, very chocolatey. And this is a good quality chocolate, so this is gonna melt very, very nice and smooth. So we're gonna keep stirring here. It's just gonna take a few seconds. Our mixture is nice and hot, it's gonna be great. And then we're gonna add a little bit of salt to this. Okay, so our mixture is nice and combined. We're now gonna place this in a bowl with some ice to cool this mixture down as quickly as we can and put it into our fridge. All right, while our chocolate creme anglaise is in the refrigerator, we're gonna build our poaching liquid for our pears. I have some pear nectar, some lemon juice, some sugar, some sliced lemons, and our star, our champagne. We're gonna add three cinnamon sticks and our vanilla. So we're gonna take our vanilla bean and we're going to split this very carefully right down the middle. Take your time with it. And then we're gonna take the back of the knife and scrape off all of our seeds. And then we're gonna throw the rest of our vanilla bean in there Give and give this a little bit of a stir, and we're gonna bring this to a simmer. Okay, our poaching liquid is now ready. We're gonna take our pears and peel these. Now, whenever you're peeling your pears, you wanna to try to keep that size and the shape of the pear because you wanna think about your presentation. You're gonna take your core, and you're gonna remove the core off of that pear. Drop that in. We're gonna simmer this for about 30 to 35 minutes. Okay, so our pears have been cooking for about 30 minutes. They look nice and tender. And we're gonna slowly take these out. Now we're gonna increase our heat 
to a boil, everything's gonna concentrate and it's gonna end up with a nice little syrup that we're gonna serve with our pears. Our liquid is nice and reduced. I have our chocolate creme anglaise, a nice little base of that. We're gonna take our pear, stand that up, little tiny bit of that syrup, and then I have a cardamom whipped cream, which is just gonna be so nice with this. Nice little dollop. And some toasted crushed pistachios. And now, my favorite part. We're gonna taste this. I'm gonna make sure I get a little bit of everything. Boy, is that good. The pears are awesome. You get that vanilla in there, you get the lemon, the chocolate. What a combination. This is a great dessert for any special occasion. Click the link below for this full recipe. Subscribe to the Publix YouTube channel and check out the Aprons Cooking School online playlist for more from our chefs. Enjoy.